An international team of researchers announced the discovery of a 1.5 million year old red fox fossil in Ethiopia. A total of 12 international researchers from 10 different countries, including two Ethiopians, have participated in the research. Daniel Jal has more on that. Arbamich University's History and Heritage Studies Department has organized a forum and given presentation on the remains of a 1.5 million year old red fox discovered during a five year study under the Bali Mountains. During the event, a researcher at Arbamich and Hebrew University in Israel, who is also coordinator of the researcher's team, Dr. Tegenu Gosa, gave an explanation about the research and the discovery. The researcher said the team can confirming the discovery of 1.5 million year old red fox fossils at Bali Mountain. He added that the fossil was found in 2017. Gregorian calendar and the corresponding research procedures were carried out to further strengthen the accuracy of the discovery. In 2017 Gregorian calendar we found the fossil of a red fox which is half of the jaw. It is located at the base of Bali Mountains range. So it is almost at the source of the Wabi Chevalier River, and it is 2,300 to 2,400 meters above sea level. Vice President of Research and Community Development of Arba Minch University, Associate Professor Hailu Murder Kios for his part said, the discovery is evidence of additional capacity to prove that Ethiopia has been the owner of wild animals that are not found in other worlds since ancient times. He mentioned that the purpose of the program is to publicize the discovery of the forces of the endangered and unique red fox. Therefore, he pointed out that the government and other stakeholders should pay attention to the sector and save the species from extinction. <laughs> In terms of heritage, Ethiopia has one of the wild animals that cannot be found in other worlds like Jalada Baboon in the northern mountains and the red fox we are talking about now. Therefore, these are animals that we should take special care of in terms of heritage. Director of the Institute of Culture and Language Studies at Arba Minch University, Dr. Said Ahmed said and the animals found only in Ethiopia have a great contribution to the tourism side economy and indicated that they should be given the necessary protection for their species. The discovery is the only one in the world and one makes it especially that the finding is through the efforts of Ethiopian scientists. Dr. Taganugosa is a staff member of Arbamit University, a researcher at the Hebrew University, so we can assume that this is a program that shows that Ethiopians can do works that is successful for the country. It was noted that a total of 12 international researchers from 10 different countries, including two Ethiopians, Ethiopians participated. It's a great success for archaeologists uh, in Ethiopia. Of course, Ethiopia is the cradle of humanity, where Lucy, Salam, and Ardi were also found in a far original state of Ethiopia.